Hello friends, I am Gaurav Arya and you are watching Gap, the Gaurav Arya podcast. George Fernandez, at that time the defense minister, he said that the real threat is China and everybody made fun of him. Because the next year, Kargil is gone, sir. Chinese coercion is an art by itself. You said that this has been the Chinese philosophy that when you are not there on top, just keep quiet, bide your time. The uh, South Korean film industry has come very good. You know, we say Bollywood, sir. but South Korean has got a fantastic film industry. Very good singers, rock and all that. Yes, sir. They used to big sessions in China. The minute they said Thad, they said, okay, Lotte Malls, wind up. Dangal, Indian movie, Sir. was sold in China for 1300 crores. It made 1300 crores from China. You think Indian film industry will make an anti-Chinese movie? Minute they say, okay, we will not buy any film, we will not exhibit it. The, 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 the industry packs up, yeah. Because they the make Chinese up. market is close to you, sir. Whatever we say, whatever left to us by our forefathers is our territory. Now their forefathers have not told us what they left from them. So the forefathers say that the South China Sea belongs to them. That becomes, uh, now it becomes a sovereignty issue to them. How does India solve this problem of the line of action control? Because like you very rightly said, there is no physical line. Now, haven't we gotten around solving it after 76 years? British uh, played many games in uh, pre-independent and decided many lines and they actually promulgated none. Were these maps violated during the Kargil war by Pakistan? Yeah, indeed. There was news, sir. Yeah. And it was covered by the mainstream media that Indian YouTubers had been taken to Xinjiang. Is this also part of media warfare, sir? Hello app to 10,000 advertisements in India, which were anti the government and they were publicized. And you know, nobody, you watch an advertisement, you say, okay, opposition party in India, hoga. Then somebody actually started checking up. Yeah, who is this hello app who is giving advertisements against the the ruling party? Sure. And they came across and say, okay, yeah, this means hello app belongs to ByteDance. ByteDance oh. are the owners of TikTok. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. They purchase advertisements. So this is electoral manipulation. Do you think a conflict with China is coming? Not today. Not five years. Maybe ten years down the line. 